Yo, what is going on guys? It's Toby here and I'm currently on vacation in Costa Rica. So what I'm gonna do is just drop an informational video. I said we were gonna start this series like a week or two ago, so just keep your eye out for it on occasion. I'd like to also remind all of you that we are still running the giveaway. I am extending it until this Friday, June 30th, I'm pretty sure. So what we're gonna do is have a giveaway of long tube headers, some custom RGB headlights from Striker Lights for your 2018 Plus Mustangs, an entire roll of vinyl wrap, etc, etc. If you want the full details, I will link it down in the description below, but all you have to do is pick up one of my merch shirts, and that counts as entry into the raffle giveaway. Alright, let's get straight to the video. Big brake kit upgrades will not allow you to stop any faster whatsoever, and here's why. Now this may seem a little bit counterintuitive and far-fetched, but it can be explained by a very, very simple physics formula. And that formula is frictional force equals mu times the normal force. Now in terms of the equation, mu or the coefficient of friction is the determined by the type of the material. And obviously normal force is denoted by the weight of the material. So as you guys can see, surface area is a non-determining factor of frictional force. And this may lead you to question, why exactly is that? Well, if you think about it in simple terms, if you change the orientation or increase the surface area of an object, it is not going to change the normal force or weight of the object. This can be best explained by using a plank of wood as an example. So if you were to lay a plank of wood flat, increasing its surface area, it would still weigh the same amount as a plank of wood standing up on its side, meaning that the friction remains exactly the same. In summary, if friction does not increase with increased surface area, then why exactly would you have a greater braking force with a larger caliper and larger rotor? Well, you wouldn't, and science proves it. Alternatively, a bigger caliper and bigger rotor, which is increased surface area, allows for better heat dispersion. More surface area or a larger brake rotor will allow you to get rid of the heat that is being accumulated during braking cycles, allowing for way less brake fade. So the car can go through multiple brake cycles, possibly in the form of laps around the track without getting overheated and losing and sacrificing performance. Physics also displayed that as temperature increases, friction drastically decreases. So no, a bigger brake kit will not allow you to stop faster after one brake cycle. It won't provide any benefit whatsoever unless you're going through multiple heat cycles that could expose your brake rotors and brake calipers to brake fade. Wider tires, on the other hand, will allow you to brake faster, and I can explain that in another video if you guys would like. So let me know in the comment section below if you would like to see that explanation with science. 